What is going on guys? Welcome back to Fishing with Nordby. Today we are actually doing a little bit of the hunting side of things. I haven't done any hunting on my channel ever. This is the first video related to hunting I have done, but I'm a big deer hunter, big archery hunter. We moved down from Missouri down here to Gunnersville, Alabama back in 2019 and I haven't hunted since then, but Always shot two, three deer a year with my bow and rifle, and we even got Cody a 10 point with a crossbow the year before we moved down. But I've never done any hunting on my channel, but I am going to. You guys want it? We're gonna make it happen. I know YouTube's doing some weird things with hunting, but uh, we're gonna make it happen. So today, we're here at the venue, here at Sweet Springs Venue and Lodge. There's the lodge, there's the venue building, the groomsman lounge. Scout's running around. He's gonna go set up some deer cameras with me today. But I wanna tell you a little bit about the Wish camera off the Wish app. This is a camera I got for 25 bucks. We're gonna test it out today. I'm gonna to tell you guys if it's worth it or not. So in this video, you're gonna see pictures from, we're gonna leave it out for two weeks. So towards the end of the video, you'll see what we get on our camera here. It's supposed to take videos and photos. Two weeks and we're gonna put out some craze. We also got out, got some corn. You can put corn out here in Alabama, which is crazy. I could never put corn out in Missouri. It was always just mineral, and you could only put mineral out and salt out in certain places. But here, you buy a little permit, you can put corn out. So that's pretty sweet. We got my neighbor's four-wheeler. He's letting me keep it uh, during hunting season here. Larry, you guys have seen me fish with Larry. And we're gonna take it up on some four-wheel trails I've cut out here at Sweet Springs Venue. Put the camera out, show you guys what we got going on. So with that being said, let's get on the trail. Let's go hang this camera up. We're here in the middle of the woods. We got some big old corn feeder set up. Set it up yesterday. My my neighbor Danny and I set this up and it's full of corn. So that's the first time. I've never never put out corn before. That's uh I don't know what to think about it. But we're gonna go ahead and hang this camera up. I think I'm gonna put it on this tree right here that's leaning. That way it's not shooting towards the sun, but towards the hill. You always want to face your cameras away from the sun, kind of use land or down a hill as the backdrop. If you, if you go up, sometimes the lighting messes your, your deer camera up. So uh, that's with any camera that I've, I've tried. So we're going to hang this up here real quick, turn it on. It's pretty easy. It takes four AA batteries and you put in the SD card, hit it to on doesn't give you any warnings or nothing. Um, let's hang it up. So since this tree is leaning, I shove some sticks secured behind this camera. And I'm gonna go ahead and wrap up this strap so it doesn't blow around. And and uh, also keeps these sticks in place a little better. But the deer get a little spooky if that strap blows around. The more camera, the more this camera makes noise sometimes. So, right there like that, looking at the deers. Also gonna throw around about half of this bag here and half in the other spot we have uh, on the other side of our property but it's gonna smell really good get the deer coming then they keep coming Ooh, smells just like uh sour apples so i'm just gonna kind of pour this all over here and get that scent out you don't want to just pile it up in one spot it's not natural the deer don't feed naturally that way all in one spot so get them get them going around and and eating it just feels more natural to them Somebody told me, the owner of Deer Candy told me that. Next. Let's go, Scout. Let's go. All right. 
walking up on the second setup here. I just hung the second wish deer camera, two for 50 bucks. Got me another feeder here. This one's by Whitetail Institute. It's a Moultrie feeder. And we got a bunch of corn on the ground. Um, I'm excited. So, put that corn feeder up yesterday. We are going to turn the camera on and get out of here. So, that's what the inside looks like underneath. Just so you have an idea if you buy one of these. Let's see. There it is. Put your SD card in. It'll focus. Turn that to on. Just like that. And then, close it. Now it's on. There's no 60 second delay. It's already taking pictures of me. I can't hear it though. I can't hear it though. The only reason I know that is because I tested a few out and it didn't sound like it was working. And I checked the SD card and the pictures and the little video was there. So, pictures and video. We're gonna head back down the mountain. Come check both of these here in two weeks. Oh, I'm also gonna put some craze out in this spot along with the corn. Get that scent out. Bucks like to come in to apple scent. Anything apple, anything of that nature should attract your bucks. So, let's throw some of that out. Okay, we got that on video. Just got two cameras up, pulled the four-wheeler back in the garage. We're gonna give it a couple weeks. We'll see you guys here shortly. Okay, we're just gonna run some of the footage. I'm sitting in my computer watching it with you right now. Scout and I, we set that camera up. Deer came in later that day. Looks like a little four point or five point. And you can see it walking pretty far away there. And then another one came back at night and was feeding. We got some good footage here. And I'm not gonna play it all for you guys, but just wanted to give you some good shots of everything. Uh, that we got. You can also get excited for our hunting season. We got some does that come in. Um, we got <laughs> shots of this buck here. They're actually fighting. That's pretty cool. They fought about three or four different times. That's awesome. Pretty exciting. And then we got some more daylight shots after that. Looks pretty good in the daytime. Then we got some photos. I just want to play about three or four photos back to back here. You can see it takes good still images. Moving on to our next stand. Uh, we got a couple of raccoons first off. And then we got a buck that came in. Pretty sweet. And then a daylight, same buck. And then we got three bucks. Uh, two spikes, or button bucks, and a four point and then they're fighting a little bit and then we got like three raccoons in the picture one of them about crawled on the camera and then some does came in and then here's some more still shots just to show you takes pretty good photos of the wish camera so hope you guys enjoyed that little episode i'm excited to do some hunting you can see some of my mounts up there on the wall but we are going to do some hunting here. I'm getting excited. But the Wish camera came through. It did pretty good. 25 bucks on the Wish app. Video and photos. That's its only setting. I didn't know it took video. So that's pretty sweet. But we're going to get out of here. We'll catch you next time here on Fishing with Norby.